Deep within the confines of Germany's prestigious Max Planck Institute, an elite team of astronomers hunch over observations from a long dormant satellite, painstakingly piecing together a three-dimensional map of the cosmos. As clusters of galaxies reveal their positions across the vastness of space, suddenly something stops the scientists in their tracks. Exchanging wordless glances, they look down at the shocking pattern emerging from their data, something absolutely enormous stretching across the heavens. A buzz of excitement fills the room as they trace the gigantic structure from high in the northern sky, arcing downward almost to the southern horizon, defying conventional understanding of cosmic architecture. Realizing the gravity of their discovery, the astronomers' jaws drop. Not only will this force them to take a fresh look at how our universe arranges its matter, but if their calculations are correct, this celestial colossus could be the biggest thing discovered in the entire universe so far. The Journey of Discovery This extraordinary find was revealed in February 2025, but its story began decades before, with the launch of the Rosat X-ray satellite in 1990. Rosat carried a revolutionary high-resolution telescope designed to map the entire sky in X-ray wavelengths. For nine years, this German-built marvel observed the cosmos, capturing emissions from some of the hottest regions in the universe, places where temperatures reach millions of degrees. When Rosat completed its mission in 1999, it had collected a treasure trove of data, revealing thousands of galaxy clusters scattered throughout space. These clusters, each containing hundreds of thousands of galaxies surrounded by vast clouds of superheated gas, became beacons marking the densest regions of our cosmic neighborhood. But the true significance of these observations was not yet clear. It was evident that decades of painstaking follow-up work would be required. Rising to the challenge, a team led by Hans Beringer at the Max Planck Institute for Extraterrestrial Physics took on the monumental task of precisely identifying each galaxy cluster and determining its distance from Earth. This effort grew into the Cosmic Large-Scale Structure in X-rays, or Classics Survey, which mapped cosmic structures one billion light-years from our planet. However, the team would have their work cut out for them. Much of the southern sky remained obscured by our own Milky Way galaxy, creating what astronomers call the Zone of Avoidance, a region where dense fields of stars and dust make observations extremely difficult. Despite this obstacle, they managed to create a three-dimensional map covering 86% of the sky, focusing on a spherical shell between 416 million and 826 million light-years from Earth. To determine which clusters might be physically connected, the researchers employed a sophisticated Friends of Friends algorithm. By using this approach, they were able to establish maximum distances between clusters that would allow them to be considered part of the same structure. As the analysis progressed, an extraordinarily vast network of 68 galaxy clusters began emerging across a sizable part of the visible sky. In February 2025, after exhaustive verification and analysis, the team confirmed they had discovered the largest coherent structure ever reliably measured in the cosmos. In a moment of scientific triumph, they named their discovery Kipu, inspired by the ancient Incan system of knotted strings used for recording information, a fitting tribute to a structure that appeared as a long filament with smaller threads branching from it. Unveiling Kipu Stretching 1.4 billion light years from end to end, Kipu spans a distance more than 13,000 times the length of our entire Milky Way galaxy. This makes it significantly larger than the previous record holder, the Sloan Great Wall, which extends approximately 1.1 billion light years across space. Kipu surpasses it by 300 million light years, a difference larger than the distance from Earth to the Andromeda Galaxy. The 68 galaxy clusters within this enormous expanse contain thousands of individual galaxies surrounded by enormous reservoirs of superheated gas, the very gas that emits the X-rays initially detected by Rosat. Together, these components give Kipu its staggering mass of approximately 200 quadrillion times that of our Sun, a figure that challenges human comprehension. Viewed in three dimensions, Kipu resembles a vast cosmic highway where matter concentrates along specific paths, with enormous voids between them. This pattern of filaments, nodes, and empty regions matches theoretical predictions of how matter should distribute itself on the largest scales a web spanning billions of light-years, with Kipu forming one of its most prominent threads. Interestingly, Q 
Kipu was not the only superstructure identified in the survey. There were also four others. Shapley, Serpent's Corona Borealis, Hercules, and Sculptor Pegasus. Together with Kipu, they account for a staggering 45% of all galaxy clusters, 30% of galaxies, and 25% of all matter in the surveyed volume, despite collectively occupying only 13% of the total space. Cosmic Significance Aside from its record-breaking dimensions, the discovery of Kipu also holds profound implications for our understanding of the universe. For example, when light from the early universe, the cosmic microwave background radiation, passes through Kipu's immense gravitational field, it undergoes subtle alterations. This phenomenon, known as the integrated sachs wolf effect, occurs as radiation passes through regions where matter is highly concentrated, creating fluctuations in the cosmic microwave background. In the past, this has proven difficult for scientists to fully explain. But now, Kipu and similar superstructures provide crucial context for interpreting these variations, improving our ability to study the Big Bang's afterglow with a far higher level of precision. Kipu's enormous mass also distorts our view of more distant objects through gravitational lensing. Like a gigantic magnifying glass, its gravity bends light passing near it, creating small but measurable distortions in our observations of galaxies that lie beyond. These distortions introduce potential errors into our measurements unless properly accounted for, particularly important as astronomers strive for increasing precision in their work. Perhaps most significantly, Kipu influences measurements of the Hubble constant, the fundamental value describing how quickly our universe expands. While galaxies move apart due to cosmic expansion, they also experience local velocities, known as peculiar velocities, or streaming motions. Kipu's massive gravitational influence affects these movements, potentially skewing our calculations, unless its effects are carefully disentangled from the expansion rate. What makes Kipu especially valuable to cosmologists is that it appears to conform perfectly to predictions based on the lambda cold dark matter model, our current standard framework for understanding cosmic evolution. Computer simulations based on the model generate superstructures with properties remarkably similar to Kipu, suggesting that our fundamental understanding of how matter organizes itself on the largest scales is on the right track. By studying how Kipu affects its surroundings, scientists gain new insights into the universe's largest building blocks and the invisible scaffolding of dark matter that shapes them. Serving as a cosmic laboratory, the structure allows astronomers to test theories about everything from galaxy formation to the behavior of dark energy. Future and Legacy While Kipu dominates our cosmic neighborhood today, it will not remain unchanged. Hans Beringer and his team believe this massive superstructure represents a transient configuration, explaining, quote, In the future cosmic evolution, these superstructures are bound to break up into several collapsing units. Kipu exists in a state of delicate balance, massive enough to create significant gravitational influence, yet spread across such vast distances that the universe's expansion pulls at its outer regions. Over billions of years, Kipu will gradually fragment, with sections potentially condensing into more compact structures while others drift apart. This inevitable transformation offers astronomers a unique opportunity to witness cosmic evolution in its earliest stages. By studying Kipu, scientists will be able to develop models that predict how matter will redistribute itself with the passing of time. This could be used to provide insights into how our own galaxy might meet its ultimate fate. Beyond its physical evolution, Kipu promises to reshape our understanding of galaxy development. Beringer and his colleagues note, quote, Interesting follow-up research on our findings includes, for example, studies of the influence of these environments on the galaxy, population, and evolution. The discovery of Kipu also highlights how much remains to be learned about our cosmic surroundings. If structures of this magnitude have remained undetected until now, it begs the question of what other cosmic giants might exist at more distant regions of space. As observation techniques improve and new telescopes peer deeper into the universe, Astronomers expect to find additional superstructures that will further refine our understanding of cosmic architecture. Perhaps most profoundly, Kipu connects humanity's ancient quest for understanding with cutting-edge science. Just as the Incas used their Kipus to record and comprehend the patterns of the world, 
modern astronomers use advanced technology to map the greatest patterns in existence. Both represent attempts to organize knowledge and find meaning in complexity. From knotted strings to galaxy clusters, the human drive to measure, record, and understand continues across centuries and civilizations, reaching ever outward toward the cosmos. As Hans Berner noted, these superstructures are, quote, special physical entities with characteristic properties and special cosmic environments deserving special attention. Kipu stands as not merely a record-breaking discovery, but a landmark that will guide our understanding of the universe for generations to come. <laughs>